What is up everyone? I hope y'all are doing well. My name is Ishan and welcome to the video. Man, there's only two more days left before I go back to school for my final semester of my undergrad career and it's just crazy but I'm excited to go back and finish it up and if you've been keeping up with the videos man I have a confession to make I feel like they've been coming out much longer than I anticipate them to be much longer than I want them to be so I'm gonna you know I don't want to waste any more of your time so let's get right into the video for today you know I've done a lot of crazy things in the past you know, like starting out businesses that failed starting this YouTube channel even though I felt like I wasn't ready and the list just goes on but in today's video i want to talk about two learnings that i picked up on while i was trying all these different crazy things and what you can do in order to face your fears and finally take that leap to start on the thing that's been scaring you for the longest time so i'm gonna take you all a little bit ways back to my senior year of high school where I just felt like I wanted to create content, share it with the world and share my experiences and the advice that I had within me, but I didn't really start on that. I, I didn't know how to, and I just posted random videos here and there, but it wasn't until the summer of 2020 when I finally started my Instagram page to share my advice with the world. And the way that happened was because of COVID, like with the quarantine situation and all, I just had so much more time on my hands to really self-reflect and dig deep into as to what was stopping me and what was holding me back from doing it and finally conquering those mental barriers to start it. That's when I learned lesson number one, fight your inner battles. Man, before you go out to conquer anything in the outside world, you really need to make sure you're at peace with yourself internally, which means you need to be having those conversations with yourself and overcome those mental barriers. Now, what constitutes as overcoming those mental barriers or winning? In my case, what I define it as, man, at the time, like, I'd wake up every single day, I'd be like, oh man, I want to share this with everyone, I, I want to post this, I want to post that. And right after that conversation in my head, I'd be like, yeah, but I don't really have a following, I don't know if people would like to see this, I don't want to do it for just one day, I don't know if I'm going to want to do this tomorrow. And it really got to a point where I didn't recognize that this was such a frequent conversation in my head that something really had to change and something really had to be done in order for me to stop continuously be overthinking about this thing and that's when i was like it is time to finally just start doing it instead of just continuously thinking about it every single day though i started my instagram page i still didn't post consistently i didn't know how to make some of the proper posts that fit my style but i just continued to learn along the way and figure things out as i was going through that journey but my second turning point was in the summer of 2021 where I really wanted to finally start my YouTube channel and I knew that if I was going to do that, consistency would have to be at the forefront of my efforts and my ideas and even though I'd been meaning to start my YouTube channel for the longest time, there were still roadblocks even at that time that were preventing me from doing it. You know, I was like, damn, I don't even have an intro, I don't have a proper camera, I don't even know how to plan a video, I don't know how to edit properly. And there was just a whole bunch of things, but that's where I learned my second lesson, which was you gotta just go for it even though you're not ready. Cause here's the secret, you're never gonna be ready. Like there's just no possible way for you to know every single thing before you started. So you just have to take that leap even though you're scared, even though you don't know things, because no matter what it is, you're gonna learn and figure it out along the way when you start the process. I've been on this journey for about seven months now, consistently posting twice a week, but I still face a bit of challenges from time to time, you know, when there are certain weeks where things start to pile up, it gets really hard to find that time to play and record and edit these videos. And I also hit writer's block where I don't know what to plan my videos on. And there's also some voices in my head at times that are like, you know, you should just quit because what's the point anyways? I just continue to remind myself that this is something that I've wanted for the longest time and I'm finally doing it. So I'm not going to stop now. And here's my challenge to you. If there's anything on your mind that you've been meaning to do for the longest time, but you're just scared because you don't have a certain skill set or you don't have enough time, man, just go ahead and start that thing. I promise you, you're going to learn along the way and figure those things out as you're going through that journey and that process. 
and down the line in a couple of months or a couple of years you're gonna thank yourself that you started when you did and you're gonna be like damn like i'm really glad that i did that continue to fight the inner battles and take the leap on things that scare you because they're gonna be the ones that bring you the most growth and most internal fulfillment and satisfaction anyways that is all i've got for y'all in this video if you made it this far and you got something out of it, be sure to smash that thumbs up button and if you're new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button and turning on notifications because I release two new videos every single week and I will catch all of y'all in the next video.